Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. We are up, Gabby and I, it is 8.30. That seems to be like their regular getting up time. I'm gonna show you Gabby's amazing outfit today. Remember how I tell you she always wears the same stuff? Well today, she's wearing something totally new. Da da da! <laughs> she, <laughs> she's sitting here having her breakfast. Oh. And she's got on her super cool vest. Show them what I need to get used to. It. Yeah, and show them what you found from wearing yeah. a vest. Well, like makes my posture way better. Yeah, so it makes her have to sit up. It makes her posture so cool. No, it doesn't make me sit up like it it it's like I don't know, like this I feel like Exactly. Yeah, so that's super cool. I need one of those. So she came downstairs this morning and she ran to that thing and she put it on and she's excited because she's gonna ride tonight, right? But this is actually her outfit that she came down in. She's got her jeans on again and she has on a black shirt, which she never wears. Sweater. So and she has like a, oh, your belt is sticking through there. <laughs> and she has on a t-shirt that she's never, that she never wears. Cause you won't let me. I love that t-shirt so much. And now I'm finally wearing it. Only because she wants to wear just the t-shirt that is like this thin in the middle of the Arctic freezing cold. So I always tell her she can wear it if she wears something over top of it. But yeah, uh, something this crazy is happening. Forget, so I don't have to go upstairs and I put socks on today. And she put socks on and usually she has to go get socks at the end of the day when we're getting ready to go to the barn. And today she just came downstairs with them, with them on. It's a crazy day. Really excited to ride. Yeah, she is so excited. She's got her stuff. I'm gonna ride Sabrina English. All right, yeah. And I got Sophie, how are you feeling? Better? Yeah. Look at you can tell all the red is gone from her face except for she looks like a little bit of a sunburn there. I can totally tell that she's on the mend and it's only a matter of time before she's feeling perfect again. People are saying that the bunnies can straight up jump over the fence even though it's a high fence. And yeah, apparently it is the real thing because dun da da da. He jumps over the high fence. Yeah, you're a jumper. He, they jump two fences to get together. Yeah, so meet our pregnant bunny, you guys. <laughs> we need to Clearly this girl is gonna be pregnant again and it's okay because it is the last time it's gonna ever happen because <coughs> um, these guys oh, yeah. are getting fixed. Oh yeah. my God, they're More so white. Than okay. They're so big. They're white. Yeah, we're not ready to touch them yet, but soon. Once it gets a little warmer. Outside, it's morning. It's minus 11. I'm freezing Whoa, cold. Cool. But I'm with my girl Sophie out here because she's feeling super hot. Today we're gonna get this hairbrush. Now my arms are cold, but my hands are hot. Oh, it's so chilly. She said she woke up with a headache because of this ponytail. But we put it in there so she wouldn't throw up in her hair, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I okay, should. I up six times. Six okay. times. Oh. Okay, let's go in. I'm so cold too. Look how thin she's getting. This is the first time in two days that Sophie's felt nice and cool. So I'm happy for that. I can see you're getting better. Do you feel better? Yeah, I'm so glad. So glad. And that's probably it. The end of the the end of the sickness for this year. You'll probably be good for the whole rest of this year. I felt a little dry though. Yeah, do you want a drink? Mm -hmm. What kind of drink do you want? Water. Water. Water is the best, huh? Okay, you guys, isn't this crazy? Look at Toby. I don't know if you can tell he's inside this ball. This ball that the girls have. Toby, you have to get out. He can just climb right in. <laughs> I don't know how he's gonna get out. Put him I on know. the ground there and let's see what can happen if we can get him out. That's terrible. <laughs> Dude, that is, he's like a hamster in a ball. <laughs> That's so funny. Let's see what he does. Uh, he's like, oh God. You can get out. If you can get in, you can get out. <laughs> oh, he go. just jumped out. Yeah, that's probably how he got in. Tell her friends what we're doing. I'm making um, chocolates. So we got this mold. The rest stop for me, ha 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 ha. Only that much. You can, she can't cook without eating it. When she was little, she used to eat the flour, just mm -hmm. plain flour. Mm -mm. I used to eat sugar. No, plain flour. I'm not even joking. Anyway, yeah, so Gabby just, so we just put melted chocolate in the molds and these little score bits. 
And Gabby said if she likes something, she's gonna use a lot of it. Mm -hmm. And she used a lot of it. <laughs> and she's eating it all. Come on, we're gonna make more. Yeah? So what? I'm eating ingredients. We are back at the barn finally. The girls missed their lesson on Monday, but they're gonna have their lesson on Friday. Today is my lesson. Are you jealous? Yeah, I'm riding after. Yeah. So like, when we get a farm under no circumstances, is the barn gonna be five miles away? Because it is so long to walk down. there. Whenever we come around the bend, got this. Oh, I can smell horses. Can you oh smell Oh my god, it? I can't! Yeah. I used to hate that smell and now I, I can't love feel it. Like horses. All right, let's do it. You do it too. Okay, go. <laughs> oh my gosh. Cantering is hard. No. You do. We're making so much noise. All the horses in the field are field. Their ears are probably all perked up and they're probably wondering, who's it gonna be this time? Which one's being dragged out of the field? Gabby always makes me skip and what's shocking is that when you get older and out of shape and chubby, you can't lift your body up as well. So it's like, you're like skipping, but your body's hardly coming off the ground. Blue's thinking it's his turn. Do you think it's your turn, Blue? Oh, no halters. Well, that's interesting. She must be inside because of the... <coughs> hey, pretty girl, because of the ice. She's like, this is weird. Because blue, when blue goes in a stall, his legs swell up. <laughs> She's like, put it on already. Come on, let's just go. Actually help Get me out of here. And Tex is like, don't take her. Don't take her, please. Leave her here with me. And she's like, get me out of this place. She's like, I want to go up and have treats. Yeah, there's no more food in here. Take me. Can She's standing the there looking at the food across there. Oh, can we yeah. take the shortcut? Through the woods? No, through the door. Sure. Open that door, the tack room door. Okay, hold on. So apparently, Gabby did this when she was here to help the other day. Took the shortcut. Big step. Big step. Good girl. If you can do that, you can do trap poles. Excited. That's not good. <laughs> I don't really want an excited horse to ride. Oh, because oh, mean Jasmine's in there. Open it. We didn't show you guys, but we now have a door on our locker. Everybody has a door on their locker. Super cool. There is shavings on that horse's belly. Did you brush her? Her belly! <laughs> <laughs> well, she's helping me because there's still shavings and crud on her belly. <coughs> oh, they're like, like barrettes in her hair? Okay. Okay. She's not a Christmas tree. She doesn't need balls and stuff. <laughs> you get to stay on Hillary's butt. So keep up with her, go! <laughs> <laughs> you have to get trotting! You have to get trotting! 
I'm gonna try. Make her try there, Laura. <laughs> squeeze, squeeze, kick. She's not driving yet. Oh, now we're jogging. You're good. Okay, now copy Hillary's butt. You can go far ahead. Don't put your back in the butt. There you go. Hey, oh, you got it. Hands forward. You do. That's it. You got it. Always have to have visual, doesn't it? There you go. And then you can count to help yourself. So you go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Your whole stuff is going. Oh, I got it. Come on, keep going. You can't just go back and back. You're starting to use your brain. Come on, you're using your first and pulling yourself up as opposed to your leg. horse which obviously it wasn't awesome but it's still really hard for me you guys so I got off the horse and I said I actually like really felt like I did it for a while there and I said to Sam did I look good and he said actually you did kind of look like you knew what you were doing for a few minutes and so he said yeah for a beginner though <laughs> so yeah I'm definitely a beginner but I'm still proud I can see that I really need to work with her respecting me because she doesn't and I know why she doesn't. It's because the mama in me is always looking for reasons why she's behaving the way she's behaving. And, and so I always am worried that maybe she's sore or maybe she's... I'm gonna slip on this ice. Don't slip. Or maybe she's, I don't know. I always worry that she's in pain. What I need is to get the vet to check her out 100% and tell me that she's healthy and then I'll feel much better. Okay, so because the horses were in for part of the day because of the ice, um, now that all the stalls need a mucking for like the third time or whatever, the second time, the third time. So Gabby's riding up there with a bunch of her friends and so Sophie and I have volunteered to come down and muck stalls. So Sabrina, oh, it, yeah, it's a messy one. All right, let's do it. Can you bring that wheelbarrow? Sure, I can. Okay, hey, shake it. You gotta shake it. No, there's like mostly just keychains. Oh, okay. No one's wrong with it. Keychains. Keychains. Stop. Oh. Hi guys. The bean stall's really dirty. I'm getting the hang of picking poo out of the big piles of stuff before I was scooping it and trying to spray it. Hi, I'm hanging out with my boy Ziggy. I know, me too. I'm cleaning Ziggy's stall and I'm just loving all the attention he's giving me. He's like, I know there's treats in that purse. Everybody thinks there's treats in my purse. Look how pretty he he's is, you guys. To eat my 
He is such a pretty boy. Mm -hmm. I hate that this. When he yeah, his mane is all falling out. That's the only trouble. What? His mane. Ziggy. Oh, he knows his name, Ziggy. See, look, Ziggy. I wish your owner would sell you to me. You're such a handsome man. Here you are. Oh, and then he'd be mine because I know how to handle Yeah, he would be yours because you know how to handle him. Don't eat that. <laughs> it's like, what? You can't eat that. Um, Gabby and I made chocolates today and she's eating them all. Mm. Look at them. Who's? One side. And then the other side has little... Score bits. Score bits. So, well, I do comment of the day, Gabby's going to be eating mm -hmm. all the chocolates. And poor Sylvie has not had any because she's still not feeling great. But I saved lots of ingredients so that we can yes. do it again with her. All as soon for as me. she's feeling better. Okay, first things first. Comment of the day. Nicole the Great. Gabby picked this comment. Nicole the Great said, I love your guys' vlogs. They're awesome. Here's a bunny tip. If you don't want the male going to female, put in some toys to distract them from the female. I've done that to my bunnies before and it worked. I love your haul videos and the rest. Keep up the awesome work. Nicole, P.S. Can you guys add me on SSO? My user is Nicole Silver Glass. So now all of you guys go and add her on SSO. Right? Are you going to do it? <coughs> okay. Also, whenever I get on to SSO. Yes. I've been getting messages about how bad our stirrups are all day. The breakaway ones that we bought. And I was totally confused because they're mandatory at our barn. She wants us to have them for safety so that they break away if one of us falls. And so I was confused. But then um, some somebody on Instagram, I forget her name, shoot. She sent me an article explaining why they are dangerous. And basically the article was saying that the little thing that... that points holds up the elastic. that holds the elastic kids are ripping their clothes on them when they're sliding off the horse or they're like doing damage to their skin and having injuries from it and some people are trying to get them banned but <laughs> that's not what our barn does we don't use our them barn, that way <clears throat> our barn when we're getting off we take our feet out of the stirrups the side that we get off at the left side of the horse we put our stirrup um we over put it the, out of the way so like yeah we put it over the saddle thing over so. like in front of the knee roll like here's the knee roll and then that's the end of the saddle yeah so before we get in off front, we, so we flip our stirrups <clears throat> over the saddle and then we slide down so it's never a problem for us because <laughs> at our barn that's how they do it. it they always do it safely so that's how we do it and hopefully that's the only issue with them that's the only issue that i actually read about but um that's we're stuck using them for now, right, Gabs? And did I you? love them. Gabby loves them, so that's good. And tell them what you said about your body protector. My vest. I feel confident now because I have it on. I don't know why. Um, but so I tied before. Like I would never take my feet out of my stirrups, cool downs, or. Mm, that on Sabrina because she spooks. Gabby totally feels so much more confident when she wears the body protector, which is a win-win. I love that. So I'm excited to see her jump. I did no reins. She'll no be stirrups. she'll be back in the saddle really soon. Um in just a couple of days. But anyway, that is it for today's video and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.